Hey everybody, it's Shankblocks, and today I have big news for you guys. I am gonna for real show you how to apply for the UGC program. Now, um, before we start, I just want to say sorry for the bad audio in my last video. That was pretty horrible, but I, I know how to fix that now, and if I ever do a, do a gaming a gameplay video again, it'll be fixed. So there's that, so I guess that's it, so let's get on to the video. So to apply for the UGC program, you're going to need to go down to the link in the description, and it's going to be this right here. It should say UGC catalog applications. Now, in in part one of my um, how to make a UGC hat, part two, I've been trying and trying to get find a way to help you guys, and and I I, I myself been trying to get a way to find a way to get into the UGC program. I finally have, but it's harder than it's way hard it's well not way harder it's just har, 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 harder than you think so once you go to the link it's going to send you to the deve developer form and it should say UGC applications now open and these aren't open it, the application is not open forever and please Please read all this before you um, apply. Please, you guys, you're going to need to. I didn't read all of it, so I completely screwed up on my application. Now, I am going to tell you some things that you do need to know before you apply. So, you're going to need to re read all of this all the way down to, to the bottom. And you are going to need to create a let's see where is it um let me see if i can find it oh and it says to since we says since we take time to review every application, it may take weeks for you to hear back from us. That is true because it's probably a lot of people applying for this. The application form will automatically close once the wave limit has been reached. <coughs> so, so apply as quickly as, as you are able to. So that means you have to apply as fast as you can because it will I'm guessing it will close but the window will not close it's just that the app application for you will close and so that's why you gotta hurry up now the things you have to the things you have to do are the most important things okay just I'm gonna go over the steps that are in the application. So before you start, it's gonna say that you have to choose two different types of accessories that you that you've made, two different ones, and then read what else is there, and then um, can, and then hit just hit next at the bottom. That it should sit in you to a thing that says what, what when you were born, month, day, and year. You have to put. You can't put. You can't put. Um. You have to put a. I think an age that's over 18. I'm not sure. So once you have read ev ev everything. And everything here, you, it's gonna give you a link right about. Ah, so it's gonna say ready to apply. 
please submit your applications application to this link I'm gonna click the link now for me it, it said you've already completed the survey because I have and it should say this right here UGC catalog application now this is 100% real not fake or anything so um, I think I can show you picture of what I had to do at the very end let me just find it here one second hold on ah here it is so this is what at the end it's gonna lo look like it says please upload the two different accessories you've created as a reminder, these should be at least two of the following accessory types. And you have to pick two of these that you have created. There's hat, hair, face. Now face, that's not 2D, that's 3D. Neck, shoulder, front, back, waist, and so on and so forth. And you're going to need to create one of these. I can't really pronounce it, but you're going to need to create one of these here. And to do that, you're going to have to go look it up that and the rest is right here now this right here it says please c compress your dot rbxm files into a into a zip file I've done this myself this is it's right here you have to compress it here I'll show you how to do that let me just it. okay good so these were the two things that I've submitted. Not the best at all. So then once you have your two items, you want to hold down control and left click both of them. Then right click either one and go to send to and hit expressed zipped folder. Hit that and it should give you this right over here oh sorry and sorry about the uh, laggy background I can fix that one second now I'll be right back to fix the background okay that should fi fix it. anyway let's get back into it I'm not sure if you guys can see this but we're going to end up with a folder like this you can rename it to whatever you want except not just don't just choose something that's silly just I'll, I would just name it to oops I would just name it to folder okay so once you have that and if you go inside the heel it should have your two things oh and to change your Bring them to a .rbxm file. Um, just go into Roblox Studio. Do whatever you need to do to create your hat with the right stuff in it. Then just um, go inside the 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 Explorer tab on the right and right-click your your hat. Go down to save to file and save it to wherever you want and it should be saved to an rbxm file so once you have done that you're going to need to take you're going to need to save a folder somewhere just like on your, just for reference on your desktop then you're going to need to once it's in the zip file you're going to need to put a heel like it says then next thing is is probably the thing that you is probably one of the most important things so with that is it says please upload your item creation documentation here as a reminder this should be either a short a short screen captured video it can be speeded up or 
or screenshots of of you doing your modeling of your hat and your texturing of your hat process. So that so that means you're gonna have to either take a video of you modeling and te texturing your hat. You, you can speed it up, or take a a lot of screenshots of you modeling modeling and texturing. Now I do recommend you have to have an experience to do this because I don't think they'll accept you for for basic texturing it has to be good texturing. I mean they might, they might. I'm not saying they're 100% not. It's almost like a 50-50% chance. So uh, yeah, so that's what it looks like. And um, if you guys need any help with anything about this application, then let me know. Oh, yeah, you do have to create your. Let me find it again. One second. You do have to create a. have to create one of these let me see if I can bring this up anyway so you have to create one of these now the one of these is, is something it's like um it's like um as um pictures of your creations with a yeah pictures of your creations like, um, let me see if I can find a reference. Like templates. And let me see if I can find something. So, something like. Something like um, something like this one. Oops, let me just do something like this one right here. With a, you don't have to create a book. Just create something online that has pictures of your creations. Now, the, it can't just be the hat. The picture can't can't just be the hat. It has to be the hat on a model. So just get like a, a noob model and take pictures of that put it in in a format like this and then it's going to make you upload it on the application so once you have done everything in the application you're going to need to hit submit and once you've submitted it it's going to shortly after like a few hours after it's going to send you an oh you are going to have to put in an email Working email, not not fake, has to be, and it has to be the one that's matched up with your Roblox account. And you have to put in your first name, last name, and a few other stuff. Oh, Roblox username, a few other stuff, and yeah. At the end of, like I was saying, at the end of the application, it's going to send you an email saying that thank you for. Um, applying for this application oh now the one thing is that they were only they're only going to pick a certain amount of people of course so I'm pretty sure I'm not going to pick me because I completely messed up on mine but next time it opens which it might be maybe a few months I think Ah, why heal? We hope we are. We hope you're excited f for this, as we are. Being a part of the UG UGC program is a great way to share your creations and passion for Roblox. If you are interested in in applying, please carefully read the all this stuff below. 
I mean, remember, there are a limited number of seats for this application. Sh sh should be taken se seriously, as you may have a, as you may have to wait a few weeks before having an opportunity to apply again. So I'm gonna have to wait another few weeks to apply again. So like, so um, say if I uh, say if they don't pick pick me, then I'm gonna have to wait another few weeks to apply again. If they do pick me, it should say it should say in here well, if if they do pick you. So make sure to read everything. And I think that's it for this video. So please like and subscribe i hope you guys enjoyed watching as much as i did um sharing this with you guys to help you guys out so i hope you guys do well on this and get accepted for the utc program and um so i am hoping that we reach 500 likes on this video so if we can make that, then that, that means you guys really care and support my channel. So I guess that's it. That's it for this video. I'll see you guys in, in the next one.